It's May 2024, and it looks like we've hit a plateau for generative AI. Let's talk about what that means. Plateau? Is that because you live in a cornfield? I'm in the valley. So by plateau, I mean that innovation has slowed. It's become very much predictable and incremental. You got to break this down for me. Keep it simple. In the last six months, there hasn't been any fundamental advances in generative AI. If you had to build a generative AI project, even though you hadn't read any blog posts, archive articles, or news articles, you'd be just fine building a project. Kind of like how traditional ML hasn't changed, still use an XGBoost. The real value is shifting to understand how to actually build generative AI applications, how to scope out a problem, what the correct data is, what type of model you should be using. It sounds like I should stop worrying about which technology stack I'm using and more about just trying to solve some generative AI problems. Exactly, and this shift will apply to job seekers too. So it's not about knowing the latest packages. Instead, it's sh about showing how you can apply skills for generative AI and build useful projects. So what kind of skills should I be developing? So it's about learning the fundamentals of large language models, like knowing how to prompt, knowing how to fine tune them. What are the limitations? How do you use them with and combine them with a vector search to do a rag type application? But this means I have to go talk to people with problems? <laughs>